That's how important renewing our mind is. Having the mind of Christ, putting on the mind of Christ every single morning before you walk out those doors because you're going into a world that is lost. You're going around a world that is full of temptation and lust. Lust of the flesh and, and things that are trying to pull you away from the things of God. That's why it's so important that you make it intentional to put on the mind of Christ, to get in the word so your mind is renewed. So you can walk effectively in the spirit. The Holy Spirit quickened to me one time and said this regarding a transformed, a changed, renewed mind. Many are waiting on me to reprogram and renew their minds, their way of thinking and imagination, when it's their responsibility. We're waiting on God to do something for us in this area when it's our responsibility. It's our responsibility. The good news is, church, this. You don't have to remain there. You don't have to remain living in that place, being led by the flesh, being led by, by, by feelings and emotions that are going to lie to you and trick you and lead you down the wrong path. You don't have to remain living there. You don't have to remain in that place because God desires for you to be led by his spirit. He desires for you to have a renewed mind, to put on the mind of Christ so you think like him, that you have the same thoughts like